Hello and welcome to the EQ software video tutorials. This video will show you how simple it is to create lighting cues and cue lists to control your lighting project. Let's start by simply just clicking onto the desktop icon of the programmer software. Please refer to the EQ homepage to learn more about the differences between the standard, elements and enterprise version of the programmer software. So let's start. Welcome to the programmer software. Let's start with a little overview over the different windows inside of the EQ programmer. In the top left corner, you can find a status window. The status window in the status tab gives us a lot of information, such as application drivers, a network overview, the load of the system, and some time zone information. In the top right corner, we can find the logbook window. The main logbook shows all kinds of information since the programmer has started. On the left side of the programmer, we can find the master section, which shows us the grand master fader and a lot of versatile master faders. In total, there are 63 per default. Versatile masters can be used to change the speed, effect speed, and change brightness of cue lists. Below the masters, we can find the groups. In this window, we will also find our fixtures later on. The biggest window inside the EQ programmer is the programmer window consisting out of the programmer, content and output view. Below the programmer window, we can find our pages. Pages consist out of 12 queue lists and one queue list is a program and consisting out of several queues. To open up a queue list, double click onto the QL and its number. Inside the queue list you will find all kind of control elements and we will also save our queues inside here later. Let's close this for now. Let me give you an overview over the icons inside the application toolbar. You can create a new show, you can open up an existing show, and you can save the current show file. You can also protect the EQ programmer with a password, you can patch your fixtures, and you can open up the show properties which will be saved with the show file. The application options will only be saved locally on your PC that you are using this programmer. The export icon allows us to export a programming onto an EQ device with a memory. In addition, you can also find the device manager, the RDM manager, the presets, the FX templates, the queue list, the sequencer, the DMX output, both media players and the media remote control unit, as well as the audio DSP, the action pad, and the automation window including the trigger machine. You can also find the eScript macros and the preview. You can also show and hide all windows with this button. You can record a queue, you can quick patch, go to blind mode, highlight certain fixtures and freeze the output. In addition, you can also find the clear programmer button and the reset button as well as the About dialog. 